The leaves are turning gold, the fires are lit, and we're pulling on our woolens. But what's happening to the property market? I'm Alex from Arch & Co, and this is your autumn market update for Chepstow, Caldicott, and the surrounding areas. What a year it's been for the Chepstow and Caldicott property market. We've had record sales, lowest ever supply, and unprecedented demand for homes. But what did this mean for you as an owner? Is this still a good time to be thinking about selling your home? In this market update, we share facts, stats, and opinions to help you make an informed decision. Over the last quarter, we've seen numerous homes sell in days for well in excess of their marketing prices, leaving disappointed buyers to continue with their searches. Rightmove reported that there was a shortfall of 225,000 homes for sale in the first six months of 2021, and with little sign of any significant number of properties coming to the market, as a lack of supply continues to underpin property prices. Asking prices are at a record high in all regions of the UK, with double-digit property price growth evident in 10 regions of the United Kingdom. The housing market has finally taken a breath in recent weeks following the rush of activity leading up to the final stamp duty holiday deadline in England at the end of September. Across the UK, over 200,000 completions took place in June, the highest recorded record ever, with mortgage lending hitting an eye-watering 43.8 billion over twice the monthly average over five years from 2015 to 2019. According to the Land Registry, nationally house prices have increased by 13.2% from June 2020 to June 2021. Over the same period, property sales have also increased by around 4.2%. Mortgage approval rates have increased by 98.23%. However, it is worth noting that many agents were closed during the spring of 2020, so this is likely to have an effect on the year-on-year -year data collected. As well as the national picture, how are things looking a little more locally? Year-on-year, -year, according to the price index from July 2020 to July 2021, the average house price in Monmouthshire has also increased from 274,000 to 298,000, an increase of 8.75%. The average price of a detached home has increased from 392,000 to 427,000. The average price of a semi-detached property increased from 229,000 to 247,000. Terrace properties increased from 185,000 to 203,000 and apartments from 142,000 to 149,000 pounds. However, since January this year in Monmouthshire, the average house price has actually fallen ever so slightly from £300,000 to £297,000, which could indicate a slight slowdown in the market. At present, approximately 65% of all homes advertised in MP16 and MP26 are marked as under offer, a fall of around 3% compared to the figures seen in our summer market update. However, the most dramatic statistic is that since September 2020, there were approximately 642 homes advertised for sale MP16 and MP26. This number has now fallen to 224 in this September, meaning there were 65% less properties available to buy compared to this time last year. There are also only 77 new properties launched to the market during September this year, compared to 175 in 2020, again a fall of 56%. So if you're considering selling your home in the next few months, a confidential chat right now might help you make the right decision for you and your family. Whether that decision is to sell or to stay, why not get in touch? We very much look forward to talking to you.